Hello. I finally done it. It took over a year, but I unlocked uh, the dark matter in the zombies mode. Black Ops. So in this gameplay, I had a couple weapons left. Um, the can I just unlocked there. I think it was around 54. And I had a I had, had to get two, 2,000 kills with the KN. Had a, uh, probably 800 kills with the, um, with that gun right there. <laughs> and then, uh, but yeah, so I like to use that, um, that reactive camera that you saw there. Uh, it has a lot of tiers. It has, uh, 100, start of the game, 100. 250, 500, 750, and then a thousand. So it's a good way to kind of keep in track. So that's the 750. I had like 800 kills I needed to get with that. So um, it's a good way to kind of keep track of where you're at with the gun, where you're finishing up these last kind of kill components, tactical challenges for these camos. Um, playing on the map. Tactar and Toten on the easy mode, uh, I think that's called uh, casual, you get the 250 health. Um, I don't believe there's like a, like a big difference in the spawn rate of the zombies, well there may be, or the amount of zombies, there may be. See this was the last gun I needed to rank up, uh, got real lucky, got, it was nice to be able to pull that out of the box. Um, some guns you just spin and spin forever, there's obviously a predominance to um, DLC weapons in the box these days. DLC weapons and wonder weapons. Um, certain weapons I was unable to get from the box. Uh, like for instance, the Kashka. Uh, I needed to get heavy zombie kills and mini boss zombie kills all with the Kashka and um, the best map to do that on would e easily be 9. But I spun that box so many times in nine on high rounds and never were able to get it to get the Koshka out, so that's kind of strange. I uh, actually finished up the Koshka on Voyage of the Spare. I did use the mini boss zombies on rush mode, because the mini boss zombies spawn a lot of Light Fathers. More often than in a regular game, uh, quicker succession or quicker rate. And then uh, for the Heavy, uh, uh, heavy zombies. I just went to like a casual game of uh, Voyage of Despair, probably like 30 rounds, 40 rounds maybe to get a uh, 50 or I'd maybe like maybe a 38 or something maybe to get into that particular game. But yeah, got the as you saw when I was talking, <laughs> got the black matter popping up on my screen. Um, so when I got the um, Rampart um, from the box. I needed to get a thousand kills with it. Uh, that was the last camo challenge I had. I pulled. I pulled off this. Um, what is this SMG? Pulled this SMG off the wall. This is a great area to train in. You can shoot the electric zombies. It freezes all the zombies in the water. I was getting some crazy glitch visual glitches going up high rounds. Playing around, didn't have a very good perk setup actually. Most of my perks I weren't wasn't even really using for this strat, so it kind of kind of came across this strat as I was playing. It was the first time I ever played like a casual mode on this tactical trip map. But uh, yeah, you could. This is a. I would say this is a decent strategy if you're just going for kills. Um, you don't have to put up with a lot of the BS in this map. You don't have a lot of these. You don't have catalyst. You don't have heavy. You don't have um, mini boss. So, and actually these electric ones help, to help out a lot um, to, again, freeze all the, water, the zombies in the water momentarily. So you can really just camp, I'd probably put um, a different, totally different clip perk uh, setup. Maybe keep the Zom, I don't even know, the purple one that slows the ones down. But, um, yeah, so I was kept going after I got the diamond. I wanted to get my the rainbow cambo on there, and then I, I was thinking about going to 100. Uh, around 100, but it was just obviously taking really long. I think this was a five hour game. I just decided to quit. It's like, screw it. And then I'll just show right here on um, the, you know, the end, the end of the game screen, the, the unlock screens, the reward screen. But, um, don't know if it was worth it. <laughs> I haven't, 
getting pretty burnt out on zombies these days, but um, in this game mode at least. Uh, it was definitely a grind though. It took me longer than the Dark Matter and multiplayer. I've been playing a lot more Blackout these days. Um, that's going relatively fast. I'm probably more than 70% done with the Dark Matter in that game. Um, but appreciate anybody that would stop by and checked out the this whole update video to my progress. This is a definitely a, a grind for sure, a really hardcore grind. And then uh, I don't know how much more I'll be playing uh, this game on a consistent basis to actually take advantage of it. It'd be fun to jump in some public uh, lobbies though and show off show off the stuff I get got. But um, there it is, the dark matter. And um, I think the last screen here is just going to show the gameplay stats, uh, the time of the game, all that stuff. But, uh, hey! Salute to y'all. Have a wonderful rest of 2019. And that's it. I'm going to go right now. Bye-bye.